tomorrow I have a race. Because it's my birthday tomorrow, I have a big race. My dad gets a race with me, but I, gotta, I can't get up. Oh yeah, look at that right there. See that? Fried bread, as Ian calls it. AKA, French toast. He doesn't like it with all the sugar and all the stuff on it. He just likes it. Plain old fried bread and that is it. Fried bread for breakfast. Gorgeous. School's done for the day. I've been working all the day and Ian has uh, Came home for a little bit. Him and mom are gonna go run some errands after mom gets back. She had to go do a couple things. Mm -hmm. So Ian is jumping on his trampoline with, uh, what's that, a Tootsie Roll lollipop you got going on there? Mm-hmm. But you just opened the business, didn't you? Yeah, I just opened the glass and Come see over there. All right, come on, show me. So what happened was I would come over here and I would say, I'd walk into your shop and what do you say when I walk into your shop? How can I help you? I say, sir, I would like my glasses cleaned. Can you do that for me today? How long is that going to take? 150 minutes. And how much does it cost? Uh, 2900 Okay, so when I'm done, can I come back after I'm done shopping? Mm-hmm. All right, thank you, sir. Let me see how you clean glasses now. I, yeah, I, I do this. Yeah, put your lollipop on the napkin. I do, I spray them. Okay. I do this. I, I glue it all around. Okay. Then I spray to get all the yucky stuff. Okay. Then I wipe them off. Okay. Then, then, then you pick them up. So are my glasses clean right now? Mm-hmm. You're gonna get really odd and clean. Wow, that was a quick 150 minutes. I wish like meetings and work days would go that quick, that quickly. Hey, look, look at how clean my glasses are. Mostly. Yeah. Kinda. Well. Sort of. My son is a born entrepreneur. He loves starting businesses. He actually, over this last, before the summer actually, in the, uh, as, as the school year was coming to a close, about the last month of last school year, he would stand outside with cake pops or brownies or cookies, and when kids would walk by to school or people would be driving by, he would flag them down, and he actually made a bunch of money, if you believe it or not. So, I'm not too worried about his future. I'm pretty sure he's gonna be just fine. Very proud of him, my little businessman. Ain't that right, Ian? Mm-hmm. Yeah. We're back in Ian's shop, Mr. Blueface. That's your new name, you're Mr. Blueface. I didn't know I was named my dad. That's cause look, your face is blue, look at it. Look at, look at, look at it. Blue face. <laughs> butt face. What? What'd you just call me? <laughs> What'd you call me? I'll knock you out. A butt face. You're a butt face. You're a butt face. You're a, no, I got a slightly better idea. You're a butt face. Say. Don't believe us, kid. She's fine. All right, careful, don't spray that everywhere. Fine. Bye. So Ian and I are watching YouTube, and it's a walking tour, or HD tour of Universal Studios. And in a few weeks, we're going there. We're getting on an airplane. We are flying to Central Florida, where I used to live when I was a youngin and I uh, haven't been back there in many years. But we found a cool vacation package and uh, our family loves to travel and go hit the road and do road trips and flights and things such as those. So we are going to Universal. The uh, Central Florida is gonna get the Quinterables, whether they like it or not. So it's gonna be fun. And uh, when the time comes, we'll vlog that for you so you can uh, kind of experience the trip with us. It'd be kind of fun. So. Universal Studios, three weeks, it's coming. Oh, this kid. Hi, this is Ian, welcome to my vlog. What do you got going on here? I'm in... Is that your tablet? Yeah. All right, you got a bunch of games on your tablet, right? Yeah. What's your favorite game? Uh, yes. All right, what's it called? Family Run. Husband Run is what it's called. Husband. Okay, fire it up, let's see what it looks like. Tell me about the game. It was very good, but well, I, I was doing that first. Okay, can I play the game? Let me see what it looks like. Hey! Put it on the table so we can see it. 
called Auto Heart. Is this a fun game? Yeah. Do you recommend this to other people? Do you think other people should play this? Oh. Do you think other people or other kids would like playing this game? Yeah. We're at our, our favorite pizza haunt here in Las Vegas, and there's Ian's invention. Looks like a fire extinguisher and a water cannon all in one. Did you invent that? Uh, yeah, but I did invent it, and it, and it spikes. Taste it. Oh, no. Um, so we're ordering pizza for Ian's birthday party tomorrow. It's a gigantic pizza. You gotta see the box for this thing, and it's only like 20 bucks. 30 gigantic slices of pizza. We're getting a couple of them, so I'm excited. What do you think? Mm -mm. It's time for your spicy stuff, too. You know what I like about vlogging with Ian? He's always on topic, and um, he always answers every question Just hit crisply. Okay. Yeah. Just hit the scrabble button, and we're on. For 98 seconds. Hi. Ian. Right. What do you got going on there? These are little stuff for my party. Well, there's a whole bunch of junk on the table here. Look at whoa. All righty, tell me what you got going on here. This, these are Star and Sour, like, and Smarties and Stamps and Lizards and these other things, but I don't know what these are for. They go on your finger. Hmm. You put them on your finger. Ah! And then what's this over here? This is our Marshall Pinata. And what do you do with a pinata? You, you find a sticker, you take it off, you put the toys and candy in, and, it, and then the people don't know what it is. Yeah. All right, so what's all this for? For my party. What party is this? A slumber party. A slumber party? What? When did, who negotiated that deal? Hey, you're not having 17 kids sleep over. I think it means uh, more like your birthday party that's like a month and almost a half late. So. Oh, oh lovely. Yeah, it's lovely. Right oh, on the candy. the candy. Okay, let's hope everybody watches this uh, vlog right. after oh. the party is over. I'm not going to post this vlog until the party's over with, so sorry let's about that. Fill it up. All right, big day tomorrow, all right? Come on, put all the candy in. Okay, all the all the monsters too. Everything in. Coins. Go ahead. I get like a full stuff. I didn't know it's gonna fit all that candy and stuff. These the stickers can't fit, but that's. They're going to fit. It's like Thanksgiving, just with a lot more sugar. Uh, Alright guys, that was all she wrote. It's uh, after 9 o'clock. Got a huge day tomorrow of doing stuff. There's, uh, um, there's a 5k race. I'm exhausted, I'm sorry. I've been working like an animal these last couple days. Um, 5k race tomorrow, not for me, but for Lynn. But Ian and I, we're going to go walk... In a, it's like a one mile kids race, so I'm gonna take him through that so I don't have to run, fortunately. And uh, I am probably at the point of burnout. <laughs> uh, I'm not feeling that great, I'm tired, I'm run down, and just dealing with a lot of stuff. So, finish up work, preparing for Ian's party tomorrow. Hopefully that'll give us a chance just to play around and have a good time and just rest a little bit. And uh, even though we're gonna be running all day, hopefully that'll you know, let us settle somewhat. Otherwise, life moves on. Thanks for checking out the vlog, guys. Anytime, please subscribe, hit the thumbs up button, check it out anytime. Also on YouTube and Twitter, as well as Facebook. If you just search for the word Quinterables, you will find us. So feel free to join us on any of our social medias. And thanks for hanging with us. Commander Q, I'm out. See you soon.